Hello everybody, this is Cryptic Mac Genius, and today I've got a quick simple tip for you. So, you just got your Mac, and the first thing you do is you want to install Chrome. So, let's go install Chrome. Helps if I, ah, that works. Google, yay. So let's go ahead and download Chrome. And, oh, look at that, it's done. All right, so let's install it. Installing fine. All right, so let's go open it. And you're greeted with this message. Chrome cannot be opened because it does it was not downloaded from the Apple or the Mac App Store. All right. If you're me, if you were like me when you saw this, it kind of irritated you. So, I'm going to show you how to fix this. It's quite simple, and frankly, I don't know why it was enabled by default. Because Apple wants to make everything a walled garden, and this is supposed to be a computer, not a phone. So, let's go ahead and fix this. So, first off, you go to System Preferences, and then you go to Security and Privacy. And then, under the General tab on the left, Go down to the lock and unlock it. Enter your password, and then right here. All you have to do is check anywhere. Let me zoom back out, and it says choosing anywhere makes your Mac less secure. In instead, you can allow an individual app from an unknown developer by clicking the icon. Yeah, I'm allowing everything because I'm, screw you, Apple. Anyways, lock it back up and close preferences. Now, when you open Chrome for the first time, it will pop up and say, are you sure you want to open this? Because it was downloaded from the interwebs. So, yes, we want to open. And, yay, Chrome. So, my Chrome's already set up because I deleted it to do this video, but... Anyways, that was how to enable installation of apps from the internet that did not come from the Mac Store. Thank you. This has been Cryptic Mac Genius. Please leave a comment down below on what you liked about the video. And if you dislike, please tell me why you disliked. Bye.